our signalers are a key component to what we're trying to accomplish. And, uh, you know, it's kind of tryouts. We tell our kids during spring, summer, and now fall camp that they have to be efficient with what they're doing and then we can't make mistakes on the field. So if you're going to have an up-tempo offense and you're going to try to move at the pace that we're going to move at in the fall, we have to be pretty good. And that all, honestly all starts with the signalers. And the coach is responsible for making sure those guys are uh, ready to go and we pick the three best, four best guys for game nights. And, and, and then you've gotten a lot of publicity for it. Everybody's like, what the heck is happening over there? Yeah. What the heck is happening without, again, giving away the signal? You, you know what? Honestly, we let the kids make all the signals, um, you know, and, and things like that. And it's all word association with what we do offensively. So our kids are creative and they come up with signals that are single signals. Sometimes they do multiple signals. And uh, shoot, when Josh was here, we were doing do -si does out there and it actually it was a play. So the guys have a lot of fun with it. And if you allow them to have some creativity they're going to do some pretty good things have you ever looked over there and said what the heck is it yeah you know one of the telecasts last year they were like focusing on them and trying to figure out what they were doing it was pretty cool to see um, what the kids were doing and then understanding that there was actually some meaning behind it